Greetings friends and welcome to Eurogamer. My name's Ian Higton and I don't have my overlay on. There we go. Welcome to a live stream where we're going back to the past for once. Normally we play brand new games here on Eurogamer. But today I'm having a look back at the original Saints Row game because today is two weeks to the day when the brand new Saints Row reboot will be released. The new Saints Row reboot kind of brings the gameplay into something that kind of sits in the line between Saints Row 2 and Saints Row 3. It has some of the more gang warfare style aspects of Saint Ro Saints Row 2, but more of the wackiness of 3 thrown in as well. Uh, but this is the original. This is back where it all started. This game came out in 2006, and it originally started um, its uh, development on the PlayStation 2 in 2003, believe it or not. It was codenamed Bling Bling back in those days. Um, but then, once the Xbox 360 got announced and Volition could basically utilize a lot more of the uh, the technological advancements. They uh, they redid the game for um, for the Xbox 360 era, and this is what we got. This is a game that I played back in the day, uh, 16 years ago now. So this game's almost old enough to do naughty things. In September it will be, uh, but for now, uh, it's it's all it's 15 years old and about. 10 months or something. I don't know how the calendar works. But yeah, I haven't played this in uh, in that amount of time. I did complete it back in the day, I remember. But anything in between me loading it up and completing it, I can't really remember. I think I remember the church and uh, a few of the... I think I remember blowing up a lot of stuff with rocket launchers. But... Um, uh, yeah, we're going to check out the first 90 minutes in a second. This game was reviewed, though, on Eurogamer back in the day by Kristen Reed. It got 7 out of 10. And uh, it was very, very um, much compared to Grand Theft Auto, of which this game is a bit of a, uh, you know, a wannabe. Uh, but Kristen's final paragraph of his review says, So it may lack the scope of Rockstar's finest, and it has a few multiplayer issues to sort out, but Saints Row is a decent game with a lot going for it. Sure, it's probably the most morally bankrupt game we've ever come across, but if you delight in extreme violence, language that would make Tarantino blush, be prepared for naughty words, everyone, and more forgiving... And a more forgiving take on the GTA theme, then you've come to the right game. Throw in some excellent mini games, multiplayer diversions, a huge array of customization options, and excellent production values, and Saints Row is easily a strong enough game in its own right to survive the inevitable comparisons. It seemed unlikely, but Saints Row has turned out to be a decent game, and at the very least, it should keep you going until GTA 4 rolls around at the back end of next year. If that's not a recommendation, I don't know what is. 7 out of 10. So, pretty decent game. Uh, one thing I should point out is I've lowered the music down quite a lot this game came out before the days of video game streaming um, so it doesn't have a stream safe mode and basically the whole uh, soundtrack is licensed music so I've put that down to a bit of a bubble in the background but once we start the game you should hear the volume at normal level anyway let's get it on I can always adjust the audio as we go so uh, it starts off with player creation as um, as we all know, if we've played a Saints Row game, customization has taken a big kind of... Uh, it's always been a big thing in Saints Row's games, only getting bigger and bigger uh, up until the Saints Row reboot, where for a demo, they released a Saints Row... Um, what was it called? Boss Factory, where you had so much customization options you can actually see some of those customization options put into practice in a recent preview video that I did of um, the Saints Row reboot let's just give him the world's biggest nose you can make wacky characters here and you can make even wackier characters in the in the reboot still sounds kind of quiet doesn't it the game I'll boost the audio of the game up a little bit. Don't you drive away. Okay, this might be a little bit better. Um, I won't spend too long. 
Oh, that's a, t that's a horrible moustache. I won't t spend too long making a character because we want to get into the game. Or we can make him super muscly. Super sun <laughs> Super sunburned. Face scaling. There we go. That'll do. That's the... Uh, the Well, I think in this game it's not called the boss. I think it's called the player rather than the boss. But there's a bunch of different presets you can have. Um, but this is how we're going with the player. So this game is available backwards compatibility on the Xbox Series X. That's what I'm playing it on at the moment. Uh, it does cost £8.99 to buy. Saints Row 2, though, is what? currently free. Yo, hey, man, this shit will cost you $600 in the store. Oh, whatever. Watches. Hey, I baby, watches. I can show you a good time. Oh, hell no. Man, fuck the rollers. I guess the subtitles on this in a Shit, what you think? What the nice fuck you think you're doing? Just being civic-minded is all. That's so? Yeah, some dumbass cracker went and shit all over this wall. We just cleaning it up. <laughs> <laughs> the old cheats should work, yes, Dreadpool? <laughs> what a tash. Hector says buenas noches. Start off with a drive-by, like all good gangster fiction. Man, that's loud now. Game needs to sort out his audio leveling. Wrong time, wrong place, dog. No, sh no, not me. You okay, player? Julius, let's move. Keith David, of course, plays Julius. Keith David uh, was in all the Saints Row games up until Saints Row 4. That don't look so bad. You should be fine. Ended up being the That's president. Troy. You can thank him later. Hey. The row ain't safe no more, son. We got gangs fighting over shit that ain't theirs. And you in the way, they don't care if you represent or not. It's Troy Julius, in the background. There's no time to recruit. The character that nobody we reckon, remembers. No, we need to get our asses out of here. In a minute. Look, the Rose got a problem. Come to the church when you want to be a part of the solution. All right, here we go. So, press start to enter the pause menu, huh? Now, one thing I did see when I was finding out how to... I was like, how do I play Saints Row Rotten? I really want to play it again. Um, people were saying in message boards that you should save this game often because it has a habit of um, freezing on on the uh, Xbox backwards compatibility thing. So I'm going to try and save as much as I can. Uh, is that done? I think that, I think that saved it. So here we go. I need to go meet the saints at the church. Uh, as this is running backwards, compatibil uh, backwards compatibility on the uh, Series X, there may be some graphical improvements over how I played it back in the past. I mean, I don't know if I even had a HD TV back when this game came out. But um, I think it was close. I definitely didn't have a 1080p one. If if anything, I had a 720p upscaled to a 1080i. Um, brown baggers. The the streets and everything look quite familiar, actually. I must have run around these streets quite a lot, blowing shit up. Press Y to start Third Street Saints Mission. There is actually a church in the new uh, Saints Row. I didn't get there during my time when I played it. You get there a couple of hours into the story, and I was having too much fun blowing stuff up. <clears throat> Every motherfucker here knows what we need to do. Now those bitches be riding around here thinking they own these streets. I don't care what flag. Johnny Gap on the right. Vice Kings. 
No one's making this Voiced by Daniel Day Kim. We about to lock this shit down right now. At least in these games. Yeah. Fuck yeah. Who the fuck's this guy? Troy and I found him. We're gonna see if he'll ride with us. Julius, we want to run with the Saints. He gotta be canonized. Hey, he's right, Julius. Everyone had to do it. You ready for this, player? I'm ready. Wait, what? No, no. Shit. Okay. Left trigger or right trigger punches. LB kicks. And both together block. Okay. Do they? No, they don't. It's LB and RB, I think. I don't know. There we go. There's too many! Ouchie. Damn. Did I... Was was I inducted? Successfully? <laughs> I guess that means yes. Come on, get on your feet. We all went through that. Blood in, blood out. Welcome to the Third Street Saints. Let's get down to business. If we're serious about taking back the row, we gotta let those motherfuckers know what time it is. They break it down, and it's all about respect. Get enough of it, they're gonna back off, and we're gonna move right on in. We got some friends in town that could use some help. Give them a hand. Of course, you can always drop any motherfucker flying the wrong flag. So long as word gets out that the Saints is on the row, I don't give a damn how you do it. You feel me? I feel you, Keith David. All right, I've been canonized. And I got 200 quid for getting the shit kicked out of me. Nice. You can have up to one homie. Press up to recruit. Wheel woman. You can now call for help using your cell phone. All right, can I recruit you? All right, man. Time for you to buy a piece. Oh, buy a gun at friendly fire. Okay. Let's go for it. So far, so, um, Grand Theft Auto. Really? You go, you buy, you, you go, you join a gang, you buy a gun from the gun shop. In this case, it's friendly fire. You, uh, you my backup, are you, Troy? Okay, set in. From revolvers to rocket launchers, we got what you You can purchase weapons at friendly fire. Okay, let's do it. Uh, I guess... 500. How much have I got? I've got 200. I guess I'm just going to have to go for a pistol. Wait, what other pistols are there? Oh, yeah. Just going to have to go for a Vice 9. There we go. Alright, man, what do you say we take that piece and clean up the row? Sure, why not? What's going on? Get your guns here. Who's that? Definitely a developer up on the wall there. Tombstone 12 gauged. Can we have a look at this? this? Is employees only. I'm breaking the law here. What's in the back of the shop? Can I rob this? Oh, going to an out of bounds area and my first <laughs> thought is to is can I rob it? I cannot. Okay, where are we going now? Follow me, Troy. Come on, let's do it. Is there a run? My little waddle isn't great. <laughs> Whoa! Whoops. Who are, we shoot? are you shooting at, Troy? So this is always, as uh, Kristen Reed said in his review, this is a, always a bit more forgiving, these games, than the Grand Theft Auto games. The police are less likely to chase you for wanton murder. So at the moment, we're just wandering around dealing with some other gang members. RB is sprinters. Oh, yeah, there we go. Cheers, Gavin. Dead. <laughs> There's some good random passerby screams. I think a lot of them are um, quite silly as well. The more you hear, the Sillier they get. Okay, this is your gang notoriety. Okay. Looks like that got their attention. If it ever gets too hot, go to forgive and forget. This guy's got. I can't believe I killed someone who's wearing jorts. Damn it! I feel bad now. Hey! Get into a car. Come on, Troy. Hey, how about you do me a favor huh? and not get us killed? 
Nice. The handling on the cars is pretty good. Oh, we're going to get to see a little bit of still water now. Actually, can is can I bring up a map of still water? So still water, in terms of open world games nowadays, still water is pretty small, but it still looks quite big. Saints Row 2 was also set in still water, but I think it was like 45% bigger than this or something. So it looked different. Uh, still the same place, but different layout and uh, bigger size. Oops. Oh, we're going the wrong way. Just having a look out to see this. There's not much detail really out there in the sea, is there? I forgot to program in some waves. So it's controlling pretty nice at the moment. Shooting seemed good. Do you want the police and uh, the ragdolls are Please excellent. Good idea for you to drive. I think I've missed my waypoint there because I was too busy trying to run people over. Yeah, we're going here to the forgive and forget drive through. Oh yeah, just like... Wait, how do I revert X? Yeah, that's intuitive. Just like uh, GTA, then. You drive into a uh, petrol station or whatever it is, and... The size of your donation, I can tell you regret what you've done. You can uh, cancel your... Hey, man, now that everything's taken care of, can you drop me freckle bitches? I'm Jones for a fun bag. Okay. A f Troy wants a fun bag from freckle bitches. Sure, why not? Freckle bitches is your local meat station. <laughs> Are we going to park up over here, are we? I have no idea why they decided to call this restaurant Freckle Bitches, but there we go. Oh, yeah. It's a treat. We're getting some meat, and i got a crib as well. I want to go into Freckle Bitches for a burger. Good work, player. Word has gotten out that the Saints ain't bullshitting. Now we gotta lock our rep down. Okay. Your respect bar is located at the top right hand corner of the screen. Find the snatch activity on the map, huh? Okay. Well, first, do I want some chicken bazooms? Sure. Would I like a big swallow? Sure. Can I go inside? Ah. Oh. Disappointed. Oh well, at least we got to look at some of the wacky signs. Okay, let's jump back in again. And check out the map for the snatch activity. Here we go. Oops. I'm going to do that a lot because accelerate is not the trigger. It is A. <laughs> Whoa! It wasn't me that killed a pedestrian this time. Oh, it's okay. They survived. That's... Actually, the ones I hit never survive, so fair play to that taxi driver for being... <laughs> you almost made my kids orphans, asshole. Actually, uh, should I... While I remember... Is there a... Subtitles? Here we go. It's because Wendy's mascot is a little ginger kid like Pippi Longstockings, Gavin says about freckle bitches. Oh, I see. I don't go to Wendy's very much, considering we don't have them in England, I don't think. There may be one, maybe two. I've been to a Wendy's in America before, but that was a while ago. Henrik's Drugstore. Kind of figured that the uh, the scenery would have a lot more stupid, rude jokes and Easter eggs in, but I guess not. What's this here? Beer, liquor, cigarettes, cigars, booze. Sounds like a nice shop to me. All right. uh, it looks suspiciously like a pimp hat. Am I going to have to... Um, Deal with a pimp. 
Glass. <laughs> What's going a on, bro? Pimpy Glass. Julius called and said you might be stopping by. Look, you looking for a little something, something? Because if so, I can let Peggy over there give you a ride. <laughs> God damn. <laughs> yeah, I didn't think so. Look, brother, I got to be honest. I'm trying to get a business started here. But right now, the only hoe I got is so fugly blind motherfuckers turn her down. Now, if you could bring me back some of them fine bitches who were turning trips to other pimps, I'd be able to start seeing some real money. But I ain't asking for something for nothing. I mean, you help me out, I'll cut you in on what the bitches make. And I'll spread the word that the saints are the real deal. Well, yes, we're morally bankrupt here, then, I guess. Um... So let's um, steal this. <laughs> yes. Beep beep. Ah, oh, yeah. Now we're going. Now we're rolling. Woo. Ah, uh, balls. I need a car that I can actually fit my friendos in. Uh, no, I need a car that. I... Uh, give me some. Oh, here we go. This'll do. Excuse me. Wait, no, that's not got enough room. Oh God, this car's terrible. Oh. Okay, we've dealt with one pimp. Jesus. How very early two thousands. Um, right. So you won't get any of this kind of um, language or missions in the uh, the new one. One of the reasons why they said the new one has um, grown up a bit is because it kind of... It's still got stupid, wacky humour in it, but it kind of... Um, it sidesteps all the really um, gross wannabe edgelords stuff like this. Wait, I thought I rescued one. How come? Okay. Since I've only rescued none, I swear I've rescued one. Okay, now I've rescued one. Who did I rescue the first time? Then? I want this. I want this car. Seems better. Yeah, this one looks better. Check this out. The Mockingbird. Oh, it's a gang car. So I've angered some folks, but... No! <laughs> nice! What a flip. Here we go. Please! I must recruit recruit you. Some rescue. Oops. I guess I'm easy to spot if I'm driving another gang's motor vehicle. I did have to do that. That's what these games are for. Causing maximum carnage and mayhem in the shortest amount of time. There we go. Snatch level two completed. Unlocked Will. You have unlocked Will. You can now call for him for help using your cell phone. There we go. I've earned enough respect to unlock new missions. Okay. Fine. So what's our new mission then? Saints Row Station. Saints Row Loft Crib. Los Canales Stronghold. Not 100% sure what my mission is, ne is meant to be, but let's go check out our crib and maybe something will pop up along the way. Oh, here we go. 
storage and old liquor stores being used as a Kanawha's hideout. Why don't you go over there and check it out? Okay. Find the Kanale stronghold on the map. Oh, we did that already. That is down here. So the mechanics is called rim jobs. Uh, in another example of how they've changed the language and stuff in these games for the modern audience, um, these rim jobs uh, mechanics are now called gym robs. So the same letters, just arranged in a less sex jokey way, I guess. Flip! Ah! Oh. Wait, I didn't put the marker down. There we go. Let's try and get some sweet ragdolls! Whoa! Oh, damn lamppost. Oh. Yeah! He did a barrel roll. <laughs> I'm a parasite. Okay, press Y to kick open the door, break in and kill the canales. Nothing like... There's nothing like... Oh, goodness. Well, it's kind of sparsely decorated, but they like their beard, the canales. Oh. Everyone's, everyone shoots their guns gangster style, sideways. Which I've been reliably informed will well, break your hand if you actually do that in real life. Or your wrist. You even. The, fire, the shooting feels quite punchy. Uh, quite nice and, you know, nice loud sound effects. And the ragdolls kind of help sell the uh, illusion that you're doing a lot of damage with them. Let's steal this car and try and hunt down the boss. Losing him. Oh yeah! That one went sky high. Where's he gone? Down this way? Ah, oh, nuts. Yep, yeah, there he is. I'm losing him. Allegedly. <laughs> that would have got me a five-star wanted level in GTA, I'm sure. Okay. Time for some Big shooting. Come back here, you. Need to get a little bit closer to him before I start firing, I think. My pistol's not exactly the most... Oh, no. Accurate thing at the best of times. Oh, God. Where's he gone? Has he got out of his car? He's got out of his car. Hoop! Oh no, I'm out of ammo! <laughs> I just <laughs> fucking <laughs> batter him to death. There we go. Kicked a man to death into the sea. <clears throat> the shooting is fun and responsive despite the animation loss, says Keaton Belliston. Alright. Wonderful. You have ex earned enough respect. Come on, let's bury this body at sea. Okay, no one will ever know. The perfect crime! Swoop by the church and scoop us. It's time to finish this shit. Swoop by the church and poop a scoop us. Okay. Now to get back to the church somehow. I need to find a way onto the roads. Bit of a day-night cycle as well. Are you crazy? Part of the um, move to the Xbox 360. Um, I believe this was an Xbox 360 exclusive game, actually. But part of the reason they moved to the Xbox 360 was so you could use light and shadow tech. Oh, I've got the police after me. Um, get extra lights and shadow stuff going on in the open world. Wait for Troy and Julius. I feel like a teen again watching this, says JG. I got a tip that there's a turf war going on right now. If we crash the party, we could take all those sons of bitches out at once. Ah, oh, damn. Do I need a... Be I need a bigger... I need a car with more seats. That's only got two. Yeah, I mean, this is a bit of a trip down memory lane for me as well. 
Uh, and hopefully people watching. A lot of people were a bit like, oh, the Saints Row new one. Um, it's going to be terrible. They're rebooting the series. You know, why does it need rebooting? Why does it need to grow up and stuff? Having played four hours of the new Saints Row, it really is quite silly. It's sillier than this, in fact. It's not as, um, you know, edgy rude with, like, hoes and bitches and all that kind of stuff. And it gets rid of all that. Um, but it... Um, it does have a lot... It does feel a lot sillier than this at the moment. I think it definitely Don't has a lot of silliest, silliness from 3 and 4 in it. Um, okay, we need to kill the three gang lieutenants. Hey, Elijah T. Wow, that's some good explosions. Oh, I still got no ammo. Foul oh, balls. All right, well, let's. There we go. I've got some ammo now. <laughs> Melee killing people in this game is a lot of fun. Yeah, damn, son. Murdering everyone. The shooting in this is actually quite nice. Quite arcadey, but does the job. The enemies aren't as bullet spongy as I found them to be in the Saints Row reboot either. The, en the Saints Row reboot did have some pretty. Oh, look at the wheels on that. Did have some pretty bullet spongy enemies in it. But I think so do the later Saints Row games with the aliens and stuff. Is that one in the sea? What the fuck are you doing, dude? I'm glad we found this kid. Aw. He's floating there in his socks. Okay, let's keep going. Is this a movie tie-in to Paul Blart Mall Cop, says 164 bits. If only. You on our team? No, these are... Okay, these are two gangs fighting out. So yeah, in Saints Row uh, 2022, the reboot, there are three rival gangs. Uh, Los Panteros is one of them. And there's the Idols. And then there's another one. I can't remember their name. Um, and then... Uh, oh, the mil uh, Militech or something. They're like um, a high-tech corpo, corpo company. And uh, your character works for Militech at the start. Uh, and ends up starting the Saints Row with members from the other, uh, the other gangs. So it's a complete reboot and a restart of the Saints Row kind of idea. This one, this game obviously starts with the Saints already being a gang. Albeit one that's a bit down on their luck. These guys seem to change their clothes when I get a bit closer to them. Must just be them rendering their clothes in. Red barrel explosion? No. Savage. Just blue one in the distance. Does he change a t-shirt when I get closer? No. Okay, it's just some of them. Yeah, that one on the yeah. These ones, their, their clothes are changing when I get slightly closer to them, which is weird. That car explosion is cool as fuck. Who the hell is firing rocket launchers? Come back here, you. Stop taking your jacket off before I reach you. That barrel was a right tease. You're right. That has an explosive symbol on it. Oh, okay. It's, ooh, white explosive barrels. Lose the cops. Is that a good way to lose them? This doesn't seem like the best way to lose cops, to be honest with you. I'm not sure they appreciate you killing their friends and then stealing their cars, but... 
This is how the Saints roll. The Saints roll. I don't know how to get out of here, though. The police aren't going to be able to catch me. I don't, oh, I really want that car with the spinner wheels on, but I think it's only got room for two. And we probably need to take Julius with us. How's it going, Saints Row, pal? Do you want to get in? No, he says sorry. Doesn't want to. How do we get out of here? Drop me and Julius off at the church. Look at that. Lost the cops by getting lost myself. Okay, back to the church then. Oops. Having A as the accelerator is annoying because playing with a controller, it's hard to adjust the camera without taking my finger off the accelerator. I guess that's why modern games have the trigger as the accelerator. I'm having mad flashbacks of this little bit of road. I just had like a really powerful kind of deja vu. I've been down this road before. I must have driven down that road many a time in the past. When I played that this game we did it, player. back in the day. Rose, again. I'm playing on the Xbox Series X yet, at the moment. I'm holding a meeting at the church. Swing by when you can. Will do, sir. Will do. Listen up, people. I got some serious shit to discuss. Yeah, we cleared out the road. You think for a second that's going to stop them? Unless we wipe all these motherfuckers out, they're going to keep coming. And they ain't going to be happy. It ain't going to be settled until the Canales, the Rollers, and the Vice Kings ain't nothing but a memory. Dex, you got the Canales. Ever since they hooked up with the Colombians, it's like they own this town. And with that drug money rolling in, we can't compete. Be smart how you if I had yourself. Keith David Fum's voice, I'd never go outside. I'd just sit in the house all day talking to myself. This is Kodak says the world. Troy, Keith David says motherfuckers the best in any, uh, best out of anybody in the world. Anyone but them. You scared of going against Benjamin King? Man, fuck that. I'll take King out. There he is. It's not that simple. Bullets still kill motherfuckers, right? Doesn't get much simpler than that. Johnny Gap, the board. fan favorite. I don't need a fucking babysitter. Maybe because he Keep just loves to destroy board. and kill. Who's got the rollers? I do. Lynn? The fuck you wearing blue for? I asked Lynn to hook up with the rollers. We don't know much about these fuckers, so I wanted one of us on the inside. Fuck us. I didn't think the rollers pimped hoes. <laughs> oh! <laughs> nice. Any other comments? Yeah, when you punch. Don't throw your shoulders so much. Shut up, Johnny. Hey, I'm just saying. Once we're done here, go talk to one of these guys. They'll have something for you to do. It's our time now. Let's get this shit started. All right. Harrogate. So we, uh, we, we've we gained this um, neighborhood now. And this is a thing you can do in the New Saints Row as well. Is uh, do... Uh, do missions and little side objectives in order to reclaim uh, the streets for the the new gang that you have created in the new game, the Saints Row, rather than reclaiming uh, for the the uh, the old Saints in the old Saints Row. Uh, all right. Did we have a did we have a mission? Vice King's mission or Los Canales mission. Let's do the Vice King's mission. Remember, activities earn respect. Respect is used to unlock missions. Okay, well, let's... Oh, I need to fill up my respect bar, do I? Well, the respect bar is nearly full, so... Have we got any of the destruction missions unlocked yet? Maybe not. Plastic Surgeon Activities. Is that Snatch Activity the only one? West Side Rollers. Hmm. Let me see if I can do the other mission. Is there one here that I can do? No, I need to fill my respect bar. Okay. Well, let's go and see if I can uh, do any of these other activities in the other areas that kind of locked off. Cause I can't remember how you um 
activate them. Uh, the new Saints Row game, Dreadpool, um, is uh, the map is way bigger. But um, actually, that's a good good point. Actually, um, Dreadpool, the the new map is much bigger, but the streets and the world seemed quite empty when I played it. Like this actually seems kind of busy at the moment. Uh, obviously, down in that back area, there not much is going on. Uh, the game is you know, quite old. It's only spawning people relatively close, I guess. But um, now I've pulled, parked up. We've got people fighting and shit's kicking off. Um, the new one, just it, the world did feel surprisingly empty, especially when driving around. Um, it seemed like the pedestrians and cars would be less likely to spawn when I was moving around um, at relatively fast speeds. Okay, here we go. What's this? We have an activity here. Start drug trafficking. You think you can steal from me? You think you can fucking rob me? You stupid fucking backstabbing piece of shit! Hey, what's up? I'm um, sorry about the mess. Billy here thought it'd be a good idea to skim off the top and well. Let's just say he was wrong. Are you looking for work? Billy used to watch my back on deliveries, but nice I don't nipples. Think he's gonna make it in today. You make sure my deals go smoothly. I'll cut you in on the action. Ah, oh, I was gonna move myself over and give his nip nip norps a little tweak, but uh, unfortunately not. <clears throat> Oh bloody hell! I do remember this. How to do business. <laughs> I feel like I had to do replay this mission quite a few times. Well, shit. Can I shoot or anything? Seem like I can shoot at all. Protect the dealer and the buyer. Oh, hold on. How do I? How do I slap my gun? There we go. Okay. Maybe I will be able to shoot now. I've got my gun. Are you getting him, buddy? How did I do that? Oh, I got out by accident. Sorry, I'm trying to work out how to change my gun. On that. There we go. Here we go. They never should have tried to muscle me out. That'll do it. Protect the dealer and the buyer. I'm with you, buddy. My pets love this stuff. <laughs> Her pets do? What the? Okay, protect the dealer as they drive home. Has he got a health button? Okay, that worked out all right. You good? You good, buddy? Let's do this. Oh, close the door, man. Wow, they are giving chase quite aggressively. Completed. Nice. And my respect level is up. All right, let's exit that activity. And now I should be able to do those other missions. But first, let's steal the drug dealer's van. Okay. Let's go and let's try the... Um, the Vice King's mission. Automobile. Here we go. What's up? It's Dex. 
Taking apart the Carnales ain't gonna be easy, so whenever you're ready, hit me up at the church. It was, I think it was, um, I think Johnny Gat was on the, uh, the mission I wanna do. It was Dex on the Carnales. Basically, I wanna see a bit more of Johnny Gat because he's, he's like, he is Saints Row, really, apart from the boss, AKA the player. People got very angry when Hey man, it's spoilers. Gat. Now if you think clearing out the row was fun. Oh, it's Vice King. Church. Yes. You're gonna love what I got planned for the Vice Kings. Oh uh, yeah, people got pretty mad when uh, Johnny Gat got killed off in Saints Row 3. He was brought back by aliens, I think, in Saints Row 4, or maybe the Gat Out of Hell DLC. But yeah, he's always been a popular character and. Writing him out of the series was not a good choice. Thanks for dealing with the bots, Night Cut. Take a seat, man. So you're Julius's new boy, huh? You don't look like much. Then again, I don't look like I have an eight-inch cock, so I guess we're both full of surprises. Oh my, Daniel, take him. The Vice Kings are named after one guy, Benjamin King. And that shit don't happen unless you're a professional or a badass. And in King's case... He's both. Hold up, I gotta take this. Aisha, yeah. what a pleasant fucking surprise. Whoa, whoa, You whoa, summon him back from down. hell and get out of hell, says oh, Dreadpool. Okay, that's not uh, slow and that's loud. Yeah. Shit, where's she headed? No, don't worry, I got this. What's up? Some motherfuckers grabbed Aisha's sister right off the street. Shit, man, that's the sixth girl this month. We know who's doing this? Yeah. Vice Kings. No way, man. Kidnapping ain't King style. Hmm. Maybe that's like Tanya's going behind King's back. Don't know, don't fucking care. Now, Aisha said they were driving a yellow sedan. Tail those bitches back to wherever they go and get those girls back. So this is basically just a, another one of those um, recruiting missions then. Get in the car and follow the kidnapper. I mean, I'm going to be able to recruit quite a few people in this drugs van, I'm sure. <laughs> The NRG V8. It doesn't accelerate very fast and it's got some flappy doors. Oh, there it is. Back off before it. Oh no. A tailing mission. This is even worse than I expected. Tailing missions are the, the only thing in video games that's worse than a. Uh, uh, an escort mission, in my opinion. Quite a busy open world, really. Lots of big buildings. You can't go in any of them. It's, it's just like the new one, actually, to be honest. Although there are in the new one, there's like big, expansive deserts and stuff. But um, in the new one. There's a lot of buildings, but you can't really go in any of them, unless you're like really supposed to. And even then, most of the interior stuff happens. Um, did I fuck it up? No. After a, a loading screen. Bitch, get out the motherfucking car now! I'm not fucking playing. Break yourself, bitch! Break yourself! Break yourself! Take out resistance. All right, let's do this. Let's get a gun selected this time though. I don't have much ammo, but never mind. I'll get some once I've done some murdering. What's this? Can I, how do I get, can I jump that? One of 60 CDs. Oh, I remember CDs. So 2006. In throughout the world are 60 CDs. For every turn you find you unlock an original song. <laughs> Exciting. Uh, no, that's not how we get in though. Bit of a floaty jump. Floaty McJumperson. Wee. Wee. Alright, here we go. We're going in here. That bitch Boff. Is this yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I killed the man in jorts again. Makes me feel sick when I do that. Yeah, seems good. I've murdered a lot of enemies, but 
No innocence. The guy with the keys wants the TNA. TNA, okay. I guess I know what that's going to stand for. Is there an easier way out? I think I've got to go out the way I came. Oh, look. Do I want to continue with my drugs van? Maybe I'll be able to... How far away is it? Can I walk it? No, I'll just walk it. Is that icon on the map there? Is that a, a clothing store? Woo! Nearly got run over. I'd quite like to get some new threads. This uh, black t-shirt and jeans combo really isn't doing it for me. All right, where? Wh it's in this building. Triple X. Is there a front door? I think this might be a strip club. So what you want about Saints Row 4, but the part where you're flying a spaceship through the alien mothership while Hadaway, what his love is playing is, says uh, <laughs> Dan Matthews. Yes, I also like the intro to Saints Row 4 where you're climbing up the missile and um, uh, Aerosmith's I Don't Want to Miss a Thing plays. Okay, yeah, we're, we're in a strip club. And now it's murder time. Got the key. Big old strip club. Run! Run, people, run! So press A to replace Big Swallow with the fist. No, I don't want to exit the mission. What's the fit? Oh, I've got food. Oh. How do I... Oh, so I have to hold down B to eat the food. He, hold down B and then press the D-pad to eat the food. Okay. And I guess that he heals me up. All right, so that was a quick, uh, quick stop in a strip club. But we're back. Heading back now towards the uh, main mission. Get away from me. I like the opening to three where you're flying through the planes, says Gavin. I can't remember that bit. I've played every Saints Row game. Um, the only one I haven't technically haven't played, or maybe I shouldn't do this, just in case it cancels my mission. Um, the only one I haven't played, and it isn't technically a Saints Row game, even though it's set in the same universe, is Agents of Mayhem. Uh, Agents of Mayhem was a bit of a flop. I did preview it back in the day, a long time ago now. Uh, but uh, and it does have Johnny Gat in it, Agents of Mayhem, from what I remember. But yeah, it really didn't. It did not take off in any way, that game. It was very quickly forgotten. That's a, a teraflop and a half, in fact. Okay. I have come to rescue you, but um, I do, I'm definitely going to need a, a car with many seats. Jesus! Oh, they've got guns as well. Nice work, ladies. Shit, son. I just let you rescue yourselves. I'll give you some guns and you can rescue yourselves. How about that? Okay, is this taxi still here? Uh -uh. Yeah, let's get it. Whoa! Oh, yeah, they all died. Oh, I want this car. It's got spinning wheels on. Can you get... Oh, that's it. That's what you get for driving a taxi as a gang car. Okay, port -a -loos. Yeah! <gasps> do the port -a have loads of poos? I think they do. Can't get the camera angle right. That looks like a big poo stain on the floor there. Okay, let's go. Whoop! No! Crashed. Yeah. I'm sorry! So, 
The women I've rescued do have health bars, so I'm going to have to be careful with my driving. Don't want uh, any road traffic accidents. Except for against random pedestrians, of course. Tee hee! Pop up, whoa! Blah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Come on, big flips. Ah, oh, disappointing flips. Wouch! Crikey, it came out of nowhere. That's, that's some whiplash and a half there. Let's park up and hopefully we can get some of the Saints Row homies to help out. Okay, total earned per day, four out of 36. Hey, this is Lynn. Meet me at the arena parking lot. We got to start making a move against the rollers. A move against the rollers, you say? The rollers are... These ones, yes. Let's go do the West Side Rollers mission, because this is right in an area I've not been to yet. I remember the big sports arena. Um, can I get a better... Actually, no, this has got spinny wheels. Let's do it. Maybe. Trying to kill this dude. Oh! Sorry. Sorry. Okay. All the way to the other side of the map now. Let's try not to anger that cop. It's just pulled someone over. Ooh. Missed the turning guards. Too busy watching the cop. I think they've got their hands full, to be honest with you. Actually, if I do pass, say, an outfit store... I did say I wanted to get a change of clothes! Oh my god, this car is shagged. Bogovian Plaza. Whee! Wow, that was quite a jump. Knocked out some street lights. Sunnyvale Gardens. Okay, I see the, uh, the dome. This the arena. The Altor Dome, that's it. So Altor is a name that features frequently throughout the Saints Row series. And uh, also in um, the Red Faction series as well. There's a bit of a kind of Easter eggy reference. Whoa. They just killed those cops. I'm going to steal that shotgun. Do I get it? Not much ammo, but yeah. Let's test this shotgun out on them. Um. Okay, it takes the wheels out. Ooh. Nice! Nice physics in this game. I think this uses a Havoc physics engine. That's some crazy shit. It is, isn't it? <laughs> and some satisfying ragdolls. Oh, there's... Look at this car. I like this car. Excuse me. Get out, please. My car. I asked you nicely. Now I'm just going to sit on your dead body and uh, steal your car. Okay. I bet this car's not even there when I get back now. Oh! I need to fill up my respect bar again. Okay. Well, in that case kind of things we've got. We've got a racing activity. Demolition Derby. Rim jobs. Car dealer. Okay, let's head to Sloppy Seconds Clothing first. Get some new... Get some new clobber. And then we'll try and do a... Ouch! We'll try and do another activity to raise my respect. Sorry! It is. Ooh. 
I sure am looking to expand my wardrobe. Let's purchase some clothing. Okay, we can. We got lovely cat. Oh, so there is some DLC for this game, which is free that I grabbed. Um, one of those free items is a Santa hat, uh, which you can have in multiple different colours. I'm going to have a dirty red Santa hat. Uh, you can change the wear and tear, have it floppy or uh, erect. And I'm going to purchase that. One dollar. Go on then. Have we got more Santa stuff? Maybe it'll be in uh, overshirts. So the uncut stuff is a fashion brand that tied in with this. I love Aisha. So these are all uncut t-shirts. Coats. Here we go. Dirty red. There we go. I'm going to be a dirty Santa. Buttoned. Definitely. You're going to be the hottest kid in the room. Ooh. Got my top half. Uh, pants. Santa pants. Wait. Can I have jorts? Baggy jean shorts. I mean, they're jorts. Yeah, low down. There we go. They're fucking epic jorts. Holy shit. Santa wearing jorts. Oh, I didn't... I don't think I uh, I bought that then. Medium blue. That's kind of a shortsy colour. Purchase, yes. And then... Shoes. Santa boots. Red. There we go. Oh, what can I get for the wrists? Cotton wristband. Oh. I don't want to. Why would I want a cotton wristband? No, I want head. No, we don't. Okay. There we go. I'm uh, now. Uh, I'm an incredibly dirty, machine gun wielding, jorts wearing Santa. I'm ready to mess some shit up. I've got this posh car actually. Maybe I can go and. Do a racing activity. Watch your driving, buddy. I will not watch my driving. That is definitely something that I will never do. See, <laughs> I crashed into that just to spite him. I didn't. I meant to. Obviously, that wasn't an accident or anything. <laughs> Back off. I'm definitely not going to do very well in this race. Okay. Welcome to Santa's Row, says Fire Rabbit. Sanctuary had that cool Christmas DLC as well. Um, I can't remember what the D Christmas DLC was called, but I've used it as a set for some Eurogamer Christmas videos in the past. Okay, people, if you're not at the line in five, you're not racing. Look, hun, if you want to race today, you better hurry up. There's some real money to be made if you got some skills. Santa likes money. Okay, competing three types of street racing to earn cash and respect. Take a car to the indicated location. What? I've already taken it to one location. Is this part of the race? Drive between the flaming barrels to start the race. Okay. Yeah! Oh, that guy went airborne. He touched clouds. So I had to... Let me get this straight. I had to drive all the way over there in order for someone to tell me to drive all the way over he here? What? Why is the... The road markings took me an incredibly long way round, I think. Is the, is the race on this highway? That'd be cool. 
I could look at the big map and, and find out exactly where it is. I'm I, I don't want the spoilers. Are we going left? Straight on, I think. God, it's really far away. Night time in still water as well. Sorry! Oh, I remember this area as well. There's some... There's some... Three, two, one, specific go. areas that... Oh, really, um... Kick up some nostalgic memories. Oh, fuck. Wrong way. Uh, so I presume they are areas where... I've failed time and time again on a mission and had to redo that mission, much to my frustration. I've taken the lead north. This car is a beast. I like the fact that everything explodes when you drive through it as well. Like, I, I've got to say, while the dialogue uh, and, like, attitudes have aged quite a bit in some of the missions. Um, the gameplay is actually still a lot of fun. It's it's a fun game. I'm enjoying myself playing this. Continue to activity. Oh, do I want to do a level two? I don't know if I did want to do a level two. Did my maybe my how far have I got to go? What time is it? I don't want to do another one of those activities. Are there any more activities here? Okay, let's exit the activity. And see if there are any other... What's this one here? Mayhem! Mayhem's the cool... Mayhem's the one where you just have to blow up as much stuff as possible. You get mayhem activities in the new Saints Row as well. I didn't get to try one at the time, but it's basically the same kind of thing from what I gather. Hello! Press try, uh, press Y to start mayhem. Downloading Saints Row 2 for free on Xbox now, says Keaton Bellaston. Reno wants to see you in the back. All right, Dirty Santa is ready. I appreciate you coming around on They smelling your armpits. I got some shit that needs to be worked out. Some cop just transferred to town and he ain't paying me any respect. The bitch came in here running his mouth telling me he was gonna put me out of business. Now what that Uncle Tom nigga didn't know was I got a couple of cops on the payroll and they told me the raid was tonight. I want you to go out there and stir up so much shit the cops gotta look elsewhere. And while they on your ass, I can hide all the cat. I know it sounds risky, bro, but don't worry. You'll get hazard pay. Hazards are my speciality, sir. Cause widespread carnage to earn cash and respect. Now, whether this will give me a gun oh, to play with, like, I can't remember if you have to take your own rocket launchers into these things. I just remember spending hours just trying to get to the highest level on the, the mayhem missions with a rocket launcher because they were the most fun because you get to see all the explosions and the ragdolls and stuff. Fuck you! Ah, absolutely screwed a limo. I basically created that game roundabout then. Insurance fraud is the fun... Oh, insurance fraud! Holy shit! God, you just unlocked another memory. I thought insurance fraud was from uh, Grand Theft Auto. That's why you have to throw yourself in front of cars and stuff, isn't it? To earn enough money. Is that in this game? Amazing. This car is absolutely screwed. I need to take it to a rim jobs at some point. It's smoky dokey. Somerset. 
Well, we're getting a really good look at Stillwater as well. The new um, game isn't set in Stillwater. It isn't set in... Um, is it Fairport? Where 3 and 4 is set? I think it is. Uh, it's set in a brand new place called Santo Eliso. You need to do at least... Oh, I've... Well, did that do anything? That did some stuff, yeah. I need to do 50,000 in property damage. Just killing people? Okay, I get 7,000 for a person. 700 for a person, even. Cars seem to explode quite a lot. I am, however, running out of ammo. I have now run out of ammo. Oh, I've got some grenades. Okay, let's see if I can blow up these chairs and tables. Six grand for some tables. My like 29,000! Okay, I'm just spamming grenades. Oh, my grenades are infinite. Well, this changes everything. I've got something for you to report on. Boom! There we go. Oh, I thought it would keep going. Steel port, that's it. Not fair port. Steel port. Thanks, Gavin. Uh, oh, my respect is just under what I need. I'm going to... Oh, I've blown my car up. Shit. That was seemed like a good idea at the time. You get a bonus for destroying big cars. Okay. You look like a big car. So I'm going to take this. I'm going to do another mayhem mission. How far away is it? Oh, crap. Okay, not too far away, near the arena. You watch where you're walking! I need to do $100,000 damage now, so that's double of what I had to do before. If you, if you did enjoy um, this game and you enjoyed noodling around doing all the stupid little explodey things like this. Um, I think I think you'll like um, the new Saints Row. Oh, I don't have any grenades now. I've got infinite ammo on this shotgun, though. This new Sa the new Saints Row definitely has the uh, same kind of silly mini mission oh, stuff Wah! to do. Probably more, but also at the same time, I, I don't know whether nowadays our diet for video games is a little bit more, is a little bit different. The um, constant repetitive mini games may get a little bit um, repetitive for some people. I need some think big to kill. To explode. What about, what's over here? I don't think I'm going to get much points for destroying a port cabin. Or port loot. Port loot doesn't even explode. Nuts. Okay, listen, you. Come back! <laughs> I might not do this one. The time is... Uh, time is not on my side. If I kill the drivers, there we go. Get the drivers first. Then blowing up the vehicles is a lot easier. Because they don't try and escape. 14k for that. Four people in that car. Whoa! <laughs> uh, how am I doing? 73,000. I need more cars. Come on. Maybe I need to get away from the wreckage. Spawn me some more cars, please. Here we go. Damn it! Oh, freaked out the drivers. Oh, 
you blow a train up? I definitely don't have anything explosive, do I? No. If I can... Ooh. Traffic warden. There we go. This should do it. So the traffic warden's car is not exactly a big car, is it? Ooh. This truck should do the job. Okay, it turns out I think, I'll, I think I've got plenty of time to do it. As long as I don't keep setting myself on fire. There we go. All done. Nice. Alright. Let's exit the activity. I have earned enough respect to unlock new missions. So. Excuse me. My car. Thank you. Now to go and try out this. What were they called? High rollers? West side rollers. <laughs> Imagine the shame of getting run over to death by one of these things. Ouch. Sorry. It's it can't even mount the curbs. It's that wee It's that weedy. It's got a little siren though. Yeah. Suck it. I ain't the police, I'm Santa! In jots. <laughs> That's a sweet ride, Lynn. Uh-huh. Oh, it's pretty sweet. Who's it for you? No one. I did it myself. The spoiler looks like Donnie's work. No way, that on a glow screams Ricky Lou. Yeah, I guess it does. What is this, fucking third grade? What do you mean? Forget it, I'll see you tomorrow. Dude, she totally wants you. Assholes. I swear to God, we're not going to be able to kill these bastards fast enough. <laughs> Aside from macho bullshit, I love games I that make you that let you make your character look like a high performance car is coming in today. It's not much, I know, so we're going to make the best of it. Jack the truck carrying the cars before it makes its delivery and take it to Samson. He'll load up the cars with a few surprises, then finish the delivery. Now get out of here before someone sees us. Okay, I will do. Uh, truck cab. Get a car and intercept the truck. Well, I've started in this, so I might as well see how far we can take it. I'm not sure how easy it's going to be to... Sorry. Had to punch fuck out of a drink's... Mascot. Ah! Fuck you, you fizzy bastard. I think he's dead. Sorry. I saw that out of the corner of my eye. I was like, he cannot be allowed to survive. <laughs> Whoa! He got brained by a lamppost. I don't think that one was my fault either. Okay. Toot toot! This is not a very fast vehicle. I'm starting to regret my decision. I think it's on the highway. Sorry! Sorry, there's a cop right there as well. Apologies! Okay, maybe if I put this... I broke my top sirens! That's no good. All right, here we go. Putting the pedal to the metal. <laughs> We're going. Ish. Is it on the opposite side of the road now? Getting closer to it. The square on the mini-map turned into a triangle. Which I presume means... Oh, yeah, here it is. Here it is. What am I supposed to do? I need to kill the driver. Doesn't look. That's the truck. Looks like there's an escort. Yes, it does, doesn't it? Maybe they're on the wrong side. Hijack the truck. Oh, God. 
Do enough damage to the truck and it will pull over. Um. Okay. Ooh. Uh oh. Cops are after me now as well. Clear off, buddy. I'm. Hey! I'm driving here! <laughs> Fuck! Asshole! Okay, doing, doing it in this car was a mistake! Oh! The truck got away. Okay, I'm, I'm picking a different car. I, uh... I failed. That's a sweet ride. I failed to get the momentum, the speed, and the damage with that mini car. So let's try with this sports car. I can't use Lynn's epic car, can I? No. All right. Here we go. This has got a bit more acceleration on it. Let's just. There's no ammo in that gun. Right, if I run out of ammo, I can just, I guess, ram into it. Now I've got this speedier car. Oh, there's a ramp there. Come on. Oh, yeah. Oh, I did loads of damage. Whoa! <laughs> Bit too much damage! <laughs> oh Christ! <laughs> Get a motorcycle and mod it to look like a reindeer. Antler handlebars and and, and all says Mr. M Binder. Is that a thing you can do? Suddenly got tricky. Cannibal says off world. That was um something I did not expect to happen. I somehow have a shotgun in my arsenal as well. All right. Indeed. I am crazy. Thanks for noticing. All righty. All righty. All right. Handbrake turn. Just every fucking time I crash on that corner. Okay, definitely don't need to pull up in front of the the truck this time. Oi! 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 It's getting away! Piss off! Oh -ha -ha. Where's it gone? It's gone so far the draw distance can't keep up with it! Come back, you! There it is. Very low on health now. Okay. Ho, ho, ho! Santa's got a pistol! That's what you get for making that difficult for me. All right, drive the truck to the garage. Bop, 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 bop. Oh, oh! <gasps> oh my. I seem to have to go right around. <gasps> what? What? I think there's an exploding car on top of my car, which is... One of my cars and my truck may be on fire. Oh shit, I was supposed to come off there. Oh no. Uh, I'm sure it's fine doing this in the middle of a highway. Yeah, 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 it's fine. It's fine. I'm, I have a vehicle lodged into part of my engine, but it's fine. It's coming with us. 
Wow. Look at still water there. Oh, God. Does this truck have a health bar? Because if it does, I'm going to guess it's pretty low. We've, <laughs> we've got a hanger on. We've got a stowaway. Whoa. We've got multiple stowaways. Oh, God. This is not the right way. Oof. Uh. Uh, is whose truck is that ahead? Oh, it's not. Okay. <laughs> oh, good God! I'm gonna be surprised if we get through this in one piece. Just trying to run. Anyone shooting at me off the road seems to be working, ish. I don't think they were shooting at me. Those those ones. These ones are. Oh, fuck. Oh, they screamed. Okay. Definitely got angry people behind me. Dead cow. This is. Oh, am I going an incredibly long way round? I think I've gone the entire circumference of the map at this point. Must be close enough ish to the garage now. The square's turned to a triangle, which probably means head downwards? I'm going to guess. Oh yeah, here we go. I mean, that doesn't look like a garage, but we did it. Eurogamer Truck Simulator, says Dan Matthews. Pretty sure I tried streaming Truck Simulator back in the day, like when I first started at Eurogamer and my PC was terrible and it didn't work. Oh, I did it. I completed that one, and it's just before five. So, um, yeah, that was a little impromptu look at uh, the original Saints Row. Because, yeah, as I mentioned, Saints Row, the reboot, is coming up two weeks today, it releases. I've done some previews of Saints Row 2022 uh, that are on this channel now. If you want to see some of that gameplay in action... I've got to say, aside from a few uh, dodgy script stuff that doesn't really gel too well with today's sensibilities, um, this is this game is still a lot of fun. It it might get a little bit repetitive in the future after doing multiple of these types of missions, and I'm sure it, it will get it can get aggravating on some of the missions as well. I'm sure there's some missions that maybe. Um, uh, are quite hard and you've got to do a lot of shit over and over again to get through them. But generally, at the start, like these first 90 minutes, I've had a lot of fun. It's silly, it's arcadey. The shooting, honestly, the shooting feels nicer than the shooting in Grand Theft Auto, the early Grand Theft Autos, which always felt a little bit difficult for me. This is definitely playing up to the strengths of chaos in a way that I appreciate. Um, I like that you can just <laughs> clock people with the butt of your pistol in the middle of the streets for a laugh. And uh, yeah, it's worth, if you've never picked it, if you've never played it before, I'd say it's worth picking up if you like open world chaos simulators. Saints Row 2 is free on the uh, Xbox to download. You can get any Saints Row game from Saints Row 2 onwards on the PC as well, but Saints Row the original was an Xbox exclusive, so you can only get this if you have an Xbox 360 and you want to buy the original disc, or an Xbox One or an Xbox Series X. In that case, you can play it backwards compatible by downloading it from the Xbox Store. It's currently about £8.99, but I think it's been on sale uh, to, uh, as low as £2 at times. But yeah, if you want, if you want a bit of Saints Row action before Saints Row 2022 comes out, then this is worth a little. Uh, it's worth a little trip down memory lane, for sure. Saints Row 2022 has uh, it shares a lot in common in the DNA of this game in terms of driving around the map, doing all these kind of side missions in order to increase influence and uh, get areas of um, Santo Eliso over to um, your gang, your control. But it definitely is wackier than this game. This game 
you know, this game has a lot of wacky stuff in it, but it's also very gang um, gang warfare kind of based. So while there's rude names and silly explosive activities, it definitely doesn't get as wacky as Saints Row uh, 2022, which is why Saints Row 2022 really is a perfect middle ground between 1 and 2 and, and 3 and 4. Um, but yeah, we'll be covering Saints Row 2022 on this channel when it comes out, hopefully a couple of days before, if we can get any preview stuff going. I really want to play some co-op of it with Zoe, so we're going to try and aim to do a co-op stream um, of Saints Row 2022. If not on launch day, then before, depending on when embargoes and stuff happen. Uh, but yes, there are... Saints Row 2022 preview videos on this channel now. Two of them, one with B-roll that was provided with me and the other is using footage that I captured from a hands-on event. So do go check them out if you haven't done already. Like this stream if you enjoyed it. Do subscribe to Eurogamer for almost daily videos about video games and have a lovely rest of your day. Coming up tomorrow, we've got a list video all about the new Pokemon games. Ooh, Gotta watch them all. Pokemon. Thanks, Monster, for keeping everyone safe and destroying the porn bots. See you all soon here on Eurogamer. Goodbye.